morning flock. I'm actually at a park right now. I figured I'd go on an adventure. I'm gonna climb a hill for you guys. Just for you. Insert awesome intro, yeah! So this is really embarrassing. I'm on top of this hill and there's this guy that's running up and down it. So I'm trying to like film in between while he's going down and then coming back up before he comes up. He definitely saw me talking to a camera. It's really awkward. Yes. <laughs> I have time though. Anyway, what I wanted to talk about, one, and he's, uh, your video, there's, you know there's that spot that the audio just goes kaplunk, um, and I'm just really curious of what your, your earliest memory, I'm just curious of what your earliest memory is, so if you can reshare that. So recently I went to my library, and I mean a while ago I signed up for the summer program, but for the young adult program after you re after you read five books you get a free book and I got the Hunger Games um, I already read this and it's a great book I love it um, but it's great to actually own it so I'm excited especially because the only one I own is Catching Fire it came up again um, the only one I own is Catching Fire and I thought it was kind of weird that of the trilogy I only have the second one I've read the whole thing but I just, yeah. So it's great. Um, I mean, the only sad part is this is my last year in the young adult program because they're like, technically, as a college student, you shouldn't be in the young adult program. And I, I felt kind of abandoned, really. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I should really go somewhere else. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go down. I'll meet you at the playground. Nani, you see that song that you showed me, The Home, by Edward Sharpen, like the Magnetic Zeros or something like that? I'm actually like obsessed with that song. Like when I find a new song that I like, I pretty much just play it on repeat. That's been my song. You know what's also really awesome? Um, so my friend gave me a band-aid yesterday and I actually had to put it to use today. And bum ba da ba ba da ba 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 Oh, it's my gosh, it's a mustache! Maggie, I wanted to tell you the story just because I think it's hilarious. Um, Anis and I went to the Field Museum last week, and it was glorious. Uh, we were supposed to go to the Shedd Aquarium because it was a free day, but, you know, a lot of people got that memo. There's a lot of people, and it was a long line, and we're like, let's go to the Field Museum! So we went, and we went in this section, and I was talking about, like, different types, and it's like giving examples of, like, amphibians and mammals. For the mammals one, one of the examples was a human, but it was this little, little doll of Belle from Beauty and the Beast, <laughs> and it was, he, like, homo sapien, human, and then parentheses was like, note, not life size, and I, it was, it was just funny. I laughed. I chortled.